Hey everyone, this is Anton Dinaj from PocketNow.com. Today we're going to look at an application which is called Voice2Text. It comes from LG and we heard about this application when LG announced the LG Optima 7 and the LG Optima 7Q which goes by the name of Quantum. This application will transcribe your voice into text making it easy for you to send text messages, emails or Twitter tweets. So uh, let's take a look. Okay, so let's start the application and uh, it will bring up a nice splash screen and since this is not our first start of the application you will not see the license agreement but make sure you read and accept that before you start using the application. What I really like about this app is that it takes full advantage of Windows Phone 7's panoramic display in hubs. Meaning you can swipe to the left and then to the left and so on until you reach the point you have started. The main screen is this. And uh, from here you can select to send a tweet, you can select to send a text message, email or a memo, plus you have a short shortcut here for settings. Swiping to the left will bring you to the Twitter part of the application and if you have your account set up with Voice2Text you will see all your updates for the people you are following right here on the screen. One more to the left brings you to the list of memos. You can use this application to make a note to self or start recording something just in order for you to play back later to remind you. Getting back to the first screen, um, let's try to send an email message using our voice and let's see how well LG's voice to text behaves in transcribing our voice to text. So the instant you tap on one of these icons right here on your home, Twitter, messaging, email or memo, the application will start listening to whatever you say and hopefully transcribe it uh, using uh, voice to text technology. So let's try and send a text message, a short one. Dear John, please note that I will be running late today. It's processing and uh, let's see the outcome. It says, Dear John, please note that I will be running late today. Fantastic. Let's take another example. When we hit the back button, it automatically asks if you want to save this message as a memo or not. We will not keep it. Let's try an email. Dear Michael, thank you very much for the email you have sent me. Everything is okay. It's processing. Dear Michael, thank you very much for the email you sent me. Everything is okay. Now, punctuation is not one of its strongest points, but uh, it's always easier to dictate rather than to uh, type all the message. Let's get back and let's try another one. Let's just try a memo this time. Note to self, do not forget to buy the flowers this weekend. Processing. Note to self, do not forget to buy the flowers this weekend. So, this was a short presentation of LG's voice-to-text application and uh, how it behaves in uh, different scenarios. Now, for this to work properly, you will have to get closer a little bit to the microphone, but for sure is a time saver for all those times that you cannot spend 5 or 10 minutes typing an email on the keyboard. Just push a certain button, start talking to your device and it will transcribe your voice to text. You can always read it afterwards, uh, make small corrections, maybe punctuation, but uh, it's working as advertised and uh, I hope you will like it. This was Anton D. Knight from PocketNow.com with a short presentation of LG's voice to text application. Thank you very much.